well, Skandari's attempt. And blocked by Nikhil Pujari. And set up for Akbari. Yeah, they get a corner, Afghanistan. Into an action from both teams. India with the first attack. Afghanistan with the second. The first shot comes in from Skandari. Gets blocked. And at the end, Akbari with a shot. Gets a block from Jeekson. And a set piece again. India will have to remember the Afghanistan team is dangerous on them. Especially with the blocks coming in for Amiri to get free. Sent in by Ahadi. It's again that near post. Brandon wants to find Liston. Oh, pass needed more. A couple of changes were being readied by India, but still no sign on when they might come on. see the Indian team wants that bit of control wants to control the tempo now making sure when the ball is pushed forward it's, it's in a short pass it's a pass that finds one of their own teammates getting the Afghanistan team out of their own house finding that space for the pace of Liston and Manvi down both wings and the pace of Sunil behind that ball that can go go over the center backs Afghanistan have scored just the one goal in this particular qualifying campaign in this group in that 8-1 defeat against Qatar now Qatar of course stable toppers taking on Kuwait later in the day half past midnight uh, that particular game India will have eyes on that but for now they will have one to keep their eyes on this fixture that one goal lead is never enough Manveer and Azizi it seems that the referee thought that he got enough of the ball and he did eventually, but did he initially? Brandon with a better ball over the top, Manveer almost getting at the end of that. But the keeper stood his ground, just pulled away at the end of it and there was just a collision that the referee thought was the reason behind letting the play go on. He is having a talking to with the goalkeeper, making sure that the next time if the occasion or the idea occurs could be a, could lead to another penalty. But that's a good run from Manveer and that's a better ball from Brandon. Stuck in two minds. Ovesa is easy. Little push on the back of Nikhil Pujari by Jabbar Sharza. India team seem to be a little less under pressure after scoring that goal seem to be coming into the rhythm of their own things we all remember that run that India went on their unbeaten run for a number of games under Igor's team match himself Chetri was looking for that first time pass for Manveer Sharif Mohammed in his way blocking that ball that could reach Manveer Manveer as well will keep running down that channel with his effort, his work rate his impeccable beard for club and country now Igor Stimac has the ability to bring in the likes of Vikram Pratap Apuya. with that pass for Nikhil Pujari Jigsen playing that ball to Apuya. Apuya with a little flick on you see Nikhil Pujari do this with Chante Apoya just trying to recreate that with Nikhil Pujari himself loves operating in that right channel now Apuya and being deployed there as well for his club this season and if he wants it to be retaken what do they do now? Do they do it again? Or they change the set piece? They change the set piece. Something similar. Brandon with a poke left footed ball in. And Warali was offside. Change of set piece, but the ball from Brandon has to be better. Whips in it, whips it in with his left foot. There wasn't much on it. And then Anwarali just straying into an offside position at the end of that. Sharza stopped by Jigson. Yeah. 
Listen, Colasso. As Afghanistan chasing him, Listen. Nikhil Bajari doing well to just read that little touch coming from Skandari. That's, that's a good little battle that we've seen on the wing. Skandari versus Nikhil Bujari get both trying to get the better of each other on occasions and Nikhil Bujari winning the last two. Especially in this half. And Skandari did cause him a few problems in the first 45. I'm sure the Igor's team match must have spoken to him and said one of the ways you can stop Skandari from causing issues is just close him down. Don't let him turn on you. Skandari, as soon as he turns, he, he can go both ways, which is causing Nikhil Pujari issues. Jackson. Manveer uh, trying to turn Skandari. Trying to be a little clever. Manveer, he had the option of just playing that ball back to Nikhil Pujari or holding that ball up for him. Gives away a free kick. Akbari. For a Hadi. Uh, Try to send it in towards Sharza. Once again, too easy to get down the wings for Afghanistan. So she's a little too tucked in giving that bit of space to Ahadi to run into the box. Had the ability or had the opportunity to take a shot, Ahadi, but wanted to just play that ball across the box, trying to find one of his teammates. Finds an Indian shirt instead. Here's Kandari. Sharza. It's Kandari once more. a very good game uh, the number 11 for Afghanistan uh, plays for a club called B36 Torshavan as Akbari takes a shot and that club of course in the Faroe Islands 11 time Faroe Island champions here's that move again this time Zoeb Amiri tries to go up but Rehmat Akbari takes a shot goes wide Muskandari trying to get through the middle of players wanting the free kick in the middle it gets none of it. Analianzwala Chante and Mahesh now are both warming up. More pace for the national team to burn with Chante. We come on either side for Liston or Manveer. And Mahesh can be deployed in that number 10 role because Brendan does have a yellow card to his name. Really good pass from Jackson and Liston. Almost taking charge in the box. Space in front of him. A good touch to take it away. But both these boys, Hanifi and Listen Colasso, battling it out with each other. And Hanifi at the end just gets a toe poke for the ball to go out for a corner. But now it gives the ability for again Raul Beke, Anwar Ali, Subashish to get into that box. Brandon sends it in. Balls for Liston, Colasso went for a special. Has the ability to hit that ball like a knuckleball, but again, just gets too much on it. Afghanistan winning the first header. Liston with time and space, takes a touch. Trying to get that knuckleball to just come down, but just goes wayward. Couldn't get it to come down in time. Excellent game down the left for Liston. Sharif Muhammad. Bopulze. Fouled. Apuya this time. Bopulze and Shars are playing as two strikers for the Afghanistan team and causing troubles every time they're on the ball alongside Skandari. And the tough, challenging game. 
Puya and Jeeks and very clean so far. Puya looks a lot more comfortable as well when the ball moves forward with Jeeks in playing that deeper role.